Welcome to my Consumer Me Vlog. Today I'll be analysing the ethical and sustainable values of two of the most recent products that I've bought. Starting off, ethical means the moral principles and values that govern action, actions that a person takes. This can also be applied to a business. Furthermore, marketing ethics covers the issues such as product safety and honesty with the customers as well as suppliers for the product. So to begin, product safety and nutritional values have to be put on every product packaging. I've got an example here of the nutritional values as well as other information about this product. Of course, it's environmentally friendly and doesn't hurt any animals as it's, as it's su suitable for vegans, which is also on the product packaging, which has to be taken into account. Furthermore, warranties and fair packaging have to be put on products such as this one and all the information required is here. As well as this, businesses have to take into account pollution, um, uh, which is an ethical and moral thing that customers such as myself take into consideration when purchasing a product. Uh, businesses also need to be in charge of their distribution channel and so for example for this iPhone I'm sure that, like it goes through a lot of distribution which all needs to be ethical so for the workers and sustainable just for the environment which I'll get onto later with the three E's of with the three E's of uh, sustainability as well as this promotion has to be correct you can't do any false or deceptive advertising which uh, which would provide negative ramifications for your business also promotional allowances to retailers can be taken into consideration uh, as well as this um, you can't do any fixed pricing or price discrimination uh, which is morally wrong as it can often lead to inf unfair competition in the market uh, so, for example, Apple doing price skimming, which is where you put uh, really high prices, is often viewed as a negative thing. So, which is why a lot of people opt for Samsung or like, a Windows phone instead of this, because this isn't a very ethical way of manufacturing. Um, so, onto the four E's of sustainability. These are ecological, so which products won't have a negative effect on the environment. Equitable, which is a confusing one, but... Um, it means like all values are equal, so for the manufacturer and the producer, and obviously they need to retain a little bit of profit. And economic, which is all the financial aspects of the of the product, as well as the business, which can all be linked back to morals. Um, I've got an example of M and S, Marks and Spencer's, the uh, the food retailer, who also do like clothes and other factors, other like products. Um, doing the right thing uh, movement which uh, involves seven pillars which are involving the customer, the culture of innovation which leads to a more innovative and sustainable product life cycle, reduction in carbon footprint which is also included in pollution, um, no more landfills again pollution, ethical which also just links all back to ethics, um, recycle consumables, a fair partner to the workforce as well as suppliers and to facilitate behavioural change through labelling which also links back to the government's change for life scheme which encourages businesses and in some cases forces businesses to change their labelling so people know what they're buying so for example here all this labelling it's all very detailed you see the fat content and everything so people know what they're buying so that's all very ethical um, some businesses such as Apple also do cause related marketing um, so when they came out with their product red um, you know scheme which is where they donated every little bit of profit they made from the product red products so such as cases to, uh, to charities which uh, increased their corporate social responsibility which is more ethical and has benefits for their business it increases brand image and uh, which overall increases profitability, so it's all a good thing. And then uh, Nissan as well, with the big turn on, uh, they have uh, better, better environmentally friendly cars and more, more economical fuel, fuel, fuel sources. Uh, so to conclude, having ethical principles is a uh, is vital for organisations. It can be really beneficial. If done incorrectly, it can be a uh, it can be wrong, as it leads to less profit, but. Overall, it is good and provides help for the business.